Hold still. I'll make this quick. The sign of victory! Yeah. All right! Hey! We do battle with all our might! Right now! Hold still. I'll make this quick. How's this? Come here! Hey, come on! Yay! All right. How about a hug? I don't think so. Yeah, I feel good. Man, could you be any weaker? Let me get him! Come here! Hey, that was a nice break from things. Thanks! I'm gonna take this one with me and pay the Don a visit. These things usually take a while, so why not hang tight at the end? I'll come over when I can. Wait, can... can I come with you? Hmm? This is union business. Not sure you'll have much to talk about. I... actually, there's something else I wanted to ask. Can't it wait till you bring the apatheia with everybody else? It's... I'd rather ask it on my own. If it's not too complicated, go and give it a try. I can't make any promises, just so you know. Thanks! I'll be right back, guys! Do you think we could ask about the Apatheia as well? Mm, that qualifies as complicated. You've got that right. Hey, wait up! Where do you think you're going? I've been to this city before, I think. That again? Well, this city does have a history with Eifried. It wouldn't have been strange for your grandfather to have come here. That's true. I'm going to go ask around a bit. 
Be careful that you don't end up like you did in Nordopolica or Mantic. I know. We'll be at the inn. All right. Let's be good kids and wait for Uncle Raven at the inn. The town's quiet now, but it could get ugly quick. Yeah, well, we've seen our fair share of ugliness. Not like this we haven't. Do you think Palastrale is just gonna take Bellius's death lying down? The Don's grandson is wrapped up in this too. I guess they can't just let things slide. The guilds sure make a big deal about their rules and settling their scores. Exactly. <sighs> what a pain. I don't get it at all. We're kinda caught up in this ourselves, you know. Just be ready if things go bad. I know.
are so many. Wipe them out at one shot. Let's eliminate them! You thought you could win? Too bad! I will use this power for justice. That's the logical outcome. Estelle and I will be resting in the inn. Uh, but, but I have to... We're going to get some rest. What about you, Yuri? I think I'll wander around a bit more. All right, sure.
You want to get some rest, Rapide? <coughs> Your friends are already resting. Yuri, please wake up. Yuri! Huh? Oh, I was really zonked out, huh? Good morning, sleepyhead. Though it's more good afternoon now, ain't it? Oh, hey, old man. You're back. What about Carol? Haven't seen him since I left the Union. I reckon he's still there. I hope he's okay. Well, since the old man's back, does that mean everything's settled with the Union? Did you see the dawn? Well, about that. As soon as the Don heard what happened with Harry and Nordopolica, he left the Union. By himself? That's not like him. Where did he go? Well, and this is just my intuition, mind you. I think he's headed for Leviathan's Claw's compound, the Manor of the Wicked. What? But Jaeger is the head of Leviathan's Claw. That's so dangerous. Well, I don't think Jaeger'd try anything against the Don. If they went up against the Union, they could lose all of their business, for one. So why did the Don go out there? Hmm. So, anyway, I'm sorry, but the Don's left the city. Well then, should we go to Leviathan's Claw's compound? You believe the old man's intuition? If the Don's going up against Leviathan's Claw, we can't very well sit around and twiddle our thumbs. There's no guarantee the scum won't try to attack him. Well, all right then. I'm not really one for waiting anyway. Patty still isn't back, huh? And I guess we have no choice. We'll have to leave her behind. Estelle, will you wait here? I... I'm going with you. Estelle, don't overdo it. Are you sure you're up to this? Yes. I'm absolutely fine. Estelle... So, you all know where the Manor of the Wicked is? I figured you knew, old man. Aren't you coming with us? Well, yeah, I guess I am. Well then, it's decided. We'll just go pick up Carol and... What the... It sounded from the direction of the bridge. Uh-oh. Let's go and see.
What's with all these people here? Carol's over there. The Dawn protected this city from the Empire. He protected our honor. Even if we're the only ones helping, we owe it to the Dawn to protect the city. Hold your horses, settle down, all of you. What's all this commotion? We've heard that a group from Polistrale has been spotted near Heliord. Their leader got killed thanks to a mistake of one of our own. It's only natural they'd want to talk about the incident. Once they learn the Dawn's left town, things could get ugly. We must defend the city from them until Dawn returns. You fools. If y'all weren't so eager to fight, the Dawn wouldn't have had to leave in the first place. Soon as they learn there's fighting between guilds, don't you think the Knights are bound to stick their noses in our business again? Dongrest is independent from the Empire. The Imperial Knights are in no place to tell us what to do. The Friendship Treaty still ain't finalized yet, you know. Eerie! Everyone, what do we do? This is gonna become a war between guilds if we don't do something. If only the Dawn were here. They say that the Dawn may have gone to the Leviathan's Claw Compound, the Manor of the Wicked. What? Really? Well, probably so. We were about to see if we could go there. Wanna come with us? But there's a chance that the Dawn's not there, right? Yeah, it was just the old man's intuition after all. If he's not there, war could break out while we're out looking for him. Yuri, what should we do? What would be best? Well, we should be able to handle the manner of the wicked ourselves. You go ahead and do what you think you should do. Yeah. Then I'm gonna go and talk to everyone. Do you think this is the right choice? We don't have much choice. We can't follow the Dawn and guard the city at the same time. I hope that we find the Dawn at the Manor of the Wicked. We're his backup. If Jaeger's the one Dawn's up against, he'll need all the help he can get. Hey! You even know where you're going? It's straight to the west of here. Hey! Wait for me! If the Dawn really did go meet with Jaeger, what could the reason have been? And why would he go alone? It's not to deepen the ties of their friendship, that's for sure. It was probably because he didn't want his subordinates to get wrapped up in the mess. Well, that's just one more example of how much the guilds love doing things the hard way. Upholding every rule, settling every score. Is it all really that important? Hey, if we're going after the Dawn, now's the time. We can have special Sharon time later.
Whoa! Where are you going? We're going to meet the Dawn. I'm going too. Are you done with what you were doing? My results weren't that good, so I'm going to meet the Dawn like I first planned. I'm warning you though, our destination is Leviathan's Claw Hideout. Huh? You really don't get how things turned out that way. That's exactly my kind of place. Then follow me. Hey, hold on. What is it, old man? You do realize what going to the enemy's compound means, right? What it means? We're gonna be on their turf, playing by their rules. If we get there and we're not ready to roll, they could give us a mighty beatdown and it'd be lights out for us. So, you're asking if we're totally prepared to go? We're ready to roll, old man. You sure? You're worrying more than usual. We're ready. Yeah? Well then, let's go. What sort of fellow is this Don? He's an old man that's just larger than life. In that case, I'm sure meeting him will provide a clue to the riddle of Ifen. Hmm, Don, Don Whitehorse. Huh? Hmm? Did you say his last name was Whitehorse? Oh, uh, well, well, you just said it yourself, right? Don't get careless. Shouldn't you be using this a little more? I guess we'll fight. Destruction! Knock him around. Cut him! Destruction field! My power the tri soul shot! I just thought something up. Shouldn't you be using this a little more? Don't get careless. You got anything up there? I'm guessing this is the Manor of the Wicked. It's so heavily guarded. We should wait and see what the situation is like first. Can't get too comfortable, though. Shh, they're arguing about something. What part of let us in are you having trouble with? 
Like I said, your timing just seems a little too perfect. Don't you have anything to prove who you say you are? You know what? Actually, we don't. Let us through. The dawn is here. We don't have time to sit and chat. So, the old man did come here. Bingo! This is our chance to listen in. Didn't you go looking for proof that the hunting blades were after that dragon rider? I told you, we received word that the dawn was headed here before we could arrive at Mount Temza. We couldn't very well ignore news like that, could we? The hunting blades are out to get Judy? What are you waiting for? You won't be any use to Jaeger if we have to give you a beating. Hmm. We'll let you through, but not without an escort. You don't mind, I hope. Whatever, just let us in. What luck! Now there's less guards to worry about. Guess we better strike while the iron's hot. Who, who the hell are you? Hey! Nice, Rapide. Oh, man. All right, let's... Watch out, this one's tough. That a little too rough for you? I think we're still in the clear. So let's make with the getting inside. Why do you think the hunting blades would be after Judith? If they're looking for Epithea, maybe they want the dragon she was riding. If he's an Entelikea, he might become an Apatheia like Bellius. I mean, when he dies. Which means Harry's request wasn't the only reason they wanted to take Bellius down. They want those Apatheia something bad. Judy! Judy might be in trouble, but we should help the Dawn out first. Especially with those two charming young ladies in there. Aye, let's be quick and clean this place up. Sure. We should be on our way. I'm just worried about Judith. So you'll be going to Mount Timza? But the Dawn... We're practicing deciding for ourselves, remember? Let's move. I'm coming too! She'd be upset if I left the Dawn like this to go looking for her. I can just hear her saying, My, what did you think you were doing? Don't worry about that, lady. She's tough. All right, let's get the old Dawn out of this place. Looks like we found one more thing we can't ignore. Okay. I never would have guessed we'd have to chase down the Dawn and then go make Judith talk. It looks like the hunting blades are on the move, too. I want to know how Leviathan's Claw managed to get that information. I'm sure there's something they're after. Judith. I know you're worried, but let's just deal with what's right in front of us for now. Right. Let's look for the dawn. L look! White Horse! That's the dawn? Stand back. Didn't you say Leviathan's Claw would never try something like this, old man? The Dawn's the one that started all this. What? Then that means the old man's... Just what do you think you're doing here, you damn fools? Bringing young ones to a place like this? Bravo. I really should thank you for such a heart-rending performance. What the hell's he talking about? Uh, get out of the way. 
Let's have a good time! This old man's about dead. I'll follow up for you. Oh, brilliant angels, grant us your favor. The Don would be crazy to do this alone. Thank you, thank you! Where's the Don? He's gone after Jaeger. Let's go. I guess we'll fight. Any more foes about? Doesn't seem fair. I thought we were dead. Watch out. This one's tough. Stars throw. A flickering blaze burn. Fireball. This one's pretty tough. Don't just stand 
there whining. I'm so going to make you Ready? Resplendent crystal. Let's go. This one's pretty tough. Don't just stand there whining. Okay, let's go. This one's strong. Get ready for anything. I wonder what they were thinking, building a big manor out in the middle of nowhere like this. Isn't it obvious? Crooked plots and intrigue. We should hurry and finish what we need to do before we get caught up in anything. That's not so bad here, Estelle. Why not take our time and get the full tour? Are you thinking of exposing some crooked plots and intrigue while we're here? Nah, I wasn't thinking about any of that. Being in someone's home is just so relaxing is all. I can't believe you. We don't have time for this. We're going on ahead, old man. No, no, wait for me!
eliminate them. That's over. Let's go. I did it!
This enemy doesn't look so nice. Get ready for anything. Oh, that was mean. You okay? Okay, all right. Here we go. Yay! All right! We did it! A new skill under my belt! Yeah, I feel good.
We got a head start. Let's party! This doesn't look good. We must be cautious. Yeah. <laughs> 
This doesn't look good. We must be cautious. Shining face! This ain't a bad strategy either. This one's strong. This one's for real.
They got us from behind. Cowards!
go all out. I... I'm sorry. Victory is a whirling tie! I never dreamed you'd try anything this risky. I finally made up my mind that this mud ball would be a much prettier place without you on it. The other Master Guilds surely won't like you ignoring the Union's laws for your personal vendetta. And I'll face the consequences. But it's daybreak now. Looks like I've underestimated your touch. I'm out of time. If I don't get myself back to Dongrest, those fools gonna start a war with each other. Oh, I think it's a bit late to prevent that little accident from happening. A couple of eggs might have to be broken, but I'm prepared to pay a price. A price? You still got us to deal with, Jaeger. Well, it looks like the tide's taken a turn. Yeah, indeed. Bye-bye. Hey, wait! Damn, that guy's a regular vanishing act. Now what's with all of you? Just how you figure coming down here would be the smart thing to do? Hmm. Who's that little kid? I ain't no little kid. I'm Patty. I'm sorry about that. Patty, huh? Why don't you come over here and show me your face? Now this is a surprise. Huh? You're a dead ringer for Eifried, the very spitting image. Huh? Then it really is true that Patty is Eifried's granddaughter? Granddaughter? You're his... <sighs> I never heard nothing about that scoundrel having a granddaughter. Huh, so Patty's guess was right on the mark. As his relative, I bet you must have suffered quite a bit over Eifried's infamous incident. I've got my own reasons for following Eifried's trail. I thought that since you were his friend, Don, you might know something. <laughs> It'd be an exaggeration to say that we were ever friends. He just did whatever he wanted to do. I never knew where he was or what he was doing. And I ain't got a clue about that now, either. I see. Haven't you met him somewhere recently? Hmm, have I? Can't rightly say. This is a keepsake left by an ally of yours. We were asked to bring it to you. <sighs> Looks like I caused you all some trouble. Of all the... Why'd she have to wind up like this? Just what is an apatheia, anyway? Well, you see... I'm afraid I don't have time to explain it now. Uh, I hate to cut and run, but I'll leave the rest of these guys to you. Wait. We should think about getting out of here, too. Hey, let me try and buy the old man some time. Raven? Come on. Guess we'd better.
I am not gonna let them kill the Dawn. Hooray! I think it's about time. I agree. You don't mean... from up here? I got a bad feeling about this. We should get back to Dongrist. I'm the spitting image of Eifried. Not the picture I had in my head. Indeed. I thought he'd be an imposing figure like Don. I'm all muddled. I need to ask Don for more details. Get ready. I'm taking you down. So many! Wipe them out in one shot!
We do battle with all our might. Holy I'm just getting started. It's terrible! The Union and Polystrolli are squaring off against each other with Hope Foam Blastia! The Dawn is back, but something's not right! So, he made it back in time. Looks like my hunch was right, though. What do you mean, your hunch? He's been planning for this to end in his death all along. What? Why would he want to do something like that? To... set things right? Bellius died because of Harry's rash behavior. She's the Duce of Nordopolica. You can't just say, sorry, I got some bad information. Which means there's gotta be compensation to make up for losing Bellius. So the price Don mentioned back at the Manor of the Wicked was... His own life. Once he made up his mind to sacrifice himself, taking down Jaeger wasn't a problem. Even if it meant going against the laws. No! He can't do that! There has to be some other way. Both sides are at the breaking point, though. This thing could go off at the drop of a hat. And if it starts, it'll mean all-out war between the Union and Polistrale. Not sure we have the time to find some other way. <sighs> I'm going with Carol. Hang in there, kid. You're a boss now, right? But it's like there's nothing I can do on my own. So then ask for help. That's what friends are for, right? Don! Take good care of them. They'll be there whenever you need them. <sighs> I'm coming with you. Like hell you are! Well, old man, it's been fun. Raven. You better nail Jaeger for me. <laughs> That's a heavy load for somebody like me. <laughs> You're the only one I can ask. White Horse. Little lady, try going underground through the storeroom in the city's tavern. Mm. There's a wall there inscribed with Eifried's name. If you're his granddaughter, it ain't a bad idea to take a glimpse at the kind of things he did, and how he lived. <sighs> We're so grateful for everything your darling grandson's done to us. Really. The boy has made a mess of things. He may be my idiot grandson, but he's also a full member of the Union. And it falls upon any leader to take responsibility for the mistakes of their people. So say the laws. Take me, then. 
Let my head atone for Bellius. Dawn. Idiot. These guilds, they're all filled with nutcases. So, who's gonna be my second? It would be my honor. Guess you're stuck doing a job nobody much wants. You too. <laughs> no kidding. Yuri, I was looking forward to watching you go places. <laughs> I'll make sure to save you a spot in hell. I don't think they led me into the hell you're going to. I won't forget that attitude, boy. And I won't forget your resolve, Don Whitehorse. Don! Listen up. You all gotta stand on your own two feet from here on. There's a new age coming, so get out there and make it for yourselves. Everyone here seems to have calmed down. Feels more like they're expecting the end of the world. Carol's been taking the Dawn's passing pretty hard, too. And it looks like things are keeping the old man busy. I guess it comes with being a member of Altosk. Huh. I haven't seen Patty for a while now. She might be in the sewer tunnels. Oh, right. That's what the Don was talking about. He gave up his own life to make amends for what happened. The guilds take their laws pretty seriously. The pride of living by the laws of the guild? Taking responsibility, accepting the choices he'd made. The Don practiced what he preached. And he was willing to stake his life on those beliefs. Responsibility, choices. I've got to get these things figured out myself. Best to start with our guild, with Brave Vesperia. Yuri? Where are you? Just going for a walk. He probably went looking for Carol. Carol. Now my hands have killed someone I never wanted to kill. Don, that feeling still hasn't left my hands. You really were a piece of work, old man.
Yuri. I... There wasn't anything I could do. The Dawn and all the rest of you, you'd all made up your minds and did what you could. Nobody in this town's gonna listen to anything I've got to say. So I was thinking I should try talking with Paula Strale instead. But they might be done talking, and just attack anyway. When I thought that, I... I was too scared to go alone. So I ended up not going at all. I'm not good for anything. What about Judy? Weren't you gonna look for her? I can't. I can't go with you anymore, Yuri. I'm just not cut out to be the boss of a guild. Is that it, then? Is that all guilds and brave Vesperia mean to you? Just walking away from the dream like that? But I wanted to be the best guild! To be useful to the Dawn! For him to notice me! He's been a role model for me. And now he's not around. <laughs> so you're just gonna pack it up and quit? Just what was it the Dawn died for? You, of all people, should know the answer to that. You can always do everything you want, Yuri! You never understand how I feel! I'm not tough like you! There's no way I can be like you in the dawn! It's over! Our guild is... Carol! Don't you remember all the dawn told you? Did you forget his resolve? <sighs> As a member of our guild, I'm going to Mount Temza to find Judy. Huh? Brave Vesperia will go on, even if you don't. This guild is more than just you now. <laughs> I don't want to run away. I don't want to, but... Carol, do you think he'll be all right? He'll be fine. But... Well, now, if it isn't the darling boy and girl. How very nice to see you both. Jaeger! You've got some nerve showing your face after planting the seeds of war. Seeds of war? I'm quite sure I don't know what you're talking about. Attacking Palestrale is a matter for the Union to decide. Yep, that's right. We just helped inform their decision. <laughs> exactly. Understand, my little friends? I'll give you something to smile about. That's enough for today, I think. It is the day of the dawn's passing, after all. We're still in mourning, you see. The world lost a great man today. It most certainly did. What is it you guys are after? Get the dawn out of the way to take control of the Union? Oh, no, 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 no. 
Our little business will most surely be easier without the poor Dawn around, but... Ah, uh, let's not go there. I've come today for my own personal reasons. I don't want to disgrace the Dawn by doing something I'll regret later. You should leave before I change my mind. It is not only you who are mourning this death, you know. Be seeing you then. Even Jaeger is mourning the Dawn. I don't understand. Hadn't he been trying to get rid of Don Whitehorse himself? The old man was a nuisance to Leviathan's Claw, but maybe things were a little different for Jaeger on a personal level. You mean like the difference between guilds and individuals? Yeah. To the Don, there was Jaeger the boss and Jaeger the person. The Don did break his own laws and take the fight into his own hands. Well, we should be on our way. Uh, all right. I told Rita we would be meeting her at the town exit. I also left a message at the inn for Patty. I said he'll be fine. Let's go. Where are Carol and Patty? What is the deal with everyone worrying so much? What are both of your plans after this? I'm going with you, of course. Like I said, I've decided to stick with you guys while I research the air credit. Right, right. I want to go with you as well, Yuri. Now that we know the hunting blades are out to get Judith, we've got to try and help her. We're not obligated to do anything for her. Judith shared in our travels. She's one of us. She also destroyed the Ceres Blastia on the ship. But... I'm not going out on any mercy mission. I told you I need to set things straight, right? Yuri... What does Judy know? What doesn't she know? I'm gonna see that she comes clean about all of it. I have to. To find out where this guild stands. Well, we might just end up saving her along the way. You two are worried about her. I knew it. <laughs> what are you talking about? We might, is all I said. Anyway, with all this talk about setting the guild straight, is the fearless leader himself going to come? It'll take more than this to keep him down. He'll come. Oh, Patty's here. Did you have a look at what your grandpa left behind? I... I engraved it all firmly in my memory. So did it help you remember anything? Mmm, it doesn't look like things are gonna go quite so well. But I can't let myself get discouraged by something like that. Yeah, that's right. Is it okay for me to be with you guys a little longer? I don't mind. Okay, let's go. What should we do about Raven? He couldn't come now. He can't turn his back on this town. They lost the dawn. You're probably right. The old man has his own agenda to take care of. I'm gonna miss him. Eh, think who you're talking about. That guy might just pop up when you least expect it. So where is this Mount Temza anyway? My guess is that it's somewhere north of the sands of Kogor. She mentioned something about living with Baul on a mountain to the north of a desert. There certainly are plenty of mountains in the northern regions of Desier. Well, let's start there and see where it takes us. We'll be going to Desier by ship. Looks like that's where I come in. All right, let's head to the ship.
need. I'm going with you. I might not fully understand the things that Dawn wanted to tell me yet, but Brave Vesperia is my, no, our guild. So, so I've got to come with you guys. Carol, I think if I ran away, if I abandoned my friends, that'd be the end. I couldn't come back. That's why, that's why I've got to go. Please let me come too. Of course. <laughs> You're the boss of this outfit, Captain. Yuri, thanks! But don't call me boss anymore. Hmm? I... I haven't done anything to earn that title yet. Until you really think I'm a boss. Until I don't feel embarrassed when someone calls me boss. I'll just do my part as a fellow member of Brave Vesperia. Understood, Carol. Not a bad plan. All right! It never ends with these guilds. Bunch of hot-headed idiots. That's exactly what's so good about the guilds, I think. Hmm, yeah. Quite juvenile, isn't it? Ah! Hey, old man! Ah, how glorious is youth! What are you up to? Huh? Something wrong with my being here? Well, don't you have your hands full with the Dawn's passing and everything? You know, it all just seemed a little too bothersome, so I ducked out. But you owe a lot to the Dawn. Aren't you sad? Sad? I cried and cried till my throat was hoarse and there wasn't a tear left in me. Funny. It doesn't show on you at all. Huh. <laughs> so not even Raven the Great can bear to ignore the Dawn's parting words. <laughs> what are you talking about? You heard me, didn't you? That burden's too heavy for this beast. I'm sure they'll be able to take care of that piece of business just fine without me. All right, we'll leave it at that. Oh, man, these kids today, I tell you. Traveling in a group is loads of fun. It's so lively. This isn't lively, it's rowdy. Didn't I tell you that before? So now we can depart for Desier, right? Huh? Why are we going back there? That's a pretty good hunch you had there. Mount Thames is north of the Sands of Kagor. There's a Critian city there, if memory serves. And why would you know something like that? Well, I'm over twice your age, so of course I know twice as many things. Right. So are we going, or aren't we? Can we get to the north of Kagor by boat? Guess we'll have to see when we get there. Hoist the sails! The Fiertia is off to sea! swords for freedom, our shield for friendship, our lives for the common good. The Union Oath, huh? Do you suppose Eifried lived according to those words? Or did the wind blow differently? Well, the fact that Eifried's signature is on the oath is no simple twist of fortune. Aye. Well, we'll just have to take up the oath for Don and Eifried then, won't we? Well, Don, looks like the youth have picked up the torch you and Eifried once carried.